Um, so they can be so forgetful, can't they? Let me show you some blocks that you haven't seen before, and I am in the dining room. Clap. Right. Wait a minute. I can't see your face because I'm trying to the blocks. You might have seen this one before. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Here's the chest block. Um, and yes, I have got stuff in it. Open it. And ready for the rain. What did that there? Just open the clothes. This is the stuff you've seen before. But I have got some new blocks and some new characters that I've been showing. I think that's I'll just put that back in the thing as you know. But oh chest back in there. I don't actually know I went back on my other video uh, what I actually showed and get for something. So yeah, I see I don't think you've seen I you've seen everything actually. I don't think you've seen this though. And I've got new this is the cauldron. If you want to have a look on videos. Cauldron, you can put dice in here, you can put water in here, you can put lava in here, anything, absolutely anything like that. Right, we've got three wood and swords. Right, we've got the wooden swords. And here's an, a popper, also known as World War Day, as you've seen. Yeah. Put your hands on heart for the people who died in the war. They did very well for keeping this country safe, and they always will be. Put back in there. Yeah, you've, oh, oh no, I think you've seen that. I don't know if you've seen this though. Never act, I think I didn't show you this. But yeah, never act. I have unlimited storage now, so I can probably boost more of it, like more minutes in my videos. Right then, I, we've got a whole lot of new characters. I have a bunch of them, so let's start off with the classics Steve and Alex. Let me go for the Steve that hasn't. I have got a couple of Steves. Here's, here's Steve 1. Let me just put him down. Oh, God. I have to hold him because I'm not really focusing. Let me just put the giant camera down a little bit. Oh, no. I'm having trouble. Trouble, trouble, trouble. Trouble maker. Okay, I can't do it, but here's Steve for detail. There is some Steves out there that are different, so... Yep, look at his eyes. He's staring to his soul. As you know, there's this hack on PS4. P PC, sorry. And Xbox, but it can go on PS4. He's called Hero Brian. I've got a few of uh, Steve's actually because I've got a whole bunch of sets. I've got at least four Steve's. So yeah, same and then another one. There. Nice. Right, then we've got a different Steve, but this time he's wearing diamond armor. By the way, these characters can have a full 360 head turn their arms can move all the way up and all the way down same with the other arm and the legs can just do basically the splits pretty much it can basically do the splits so 
And also, if you you can see before, I have I usually look like at the thing, so obviously I can see the picture. But I can do that uh, on part one. But now I'm actually looking at you guys, which is a lot better. So we've got Diamond Steve, and also you can take off his head. And also, it's just a base to see. So that is one an, another thing. Let me see if there's another new box. What is that? Wait a minute. Oh. Oh. Oh no, so Steve does come with his diamond sword, and why does he turn. Oh, I put the helmet the wrong way around. That would help. He, he holds a diamond sword if you pull his arm out, which is stiff as heck. Uh, these jagged edges, I don't know if you can see, but on the sword of the handle, and if you can see that, fit into the jagged edges on the hands. Oh shoot. But uh, he is a bit loose, everything like that. And bamo, it just slides on like that. And now you can chop some mobs up and probably do something. Stupid diamond armor, Steve. I hate this guy. He kept losing his arm every time I have a look. Right. There is um, a... You probably... Everybody should know what these are. If you don't know them, I'm not sure. This is an Enderman. Uh, like, people call them Slendermans. I don't know why. Well, that's why I hear about him much every day. But I've got proper lighting now. I was in my bedroom in the old house before. By the way, I might make videos on my bedroom as well. Uh, but it's much bigger. And also, what you can do, I don't know if you can see that there's... Obviously, you can because I'm doing it now. There's like a, a stuff like that. And on the other arm, okay, I'm pulling out his leg. He has the same... as well so if I get like I bet you uh, it, these do do it quite a lot you can put a block in here you can put the edge here so it doesn't lock in but then if you get the other arm and do it the other edge guess what you can hold a block but it is very difficult to get it. Let me, let me just figure out. Here you go. He's holding the block. He's not holding it very weird though. Like, it's cool, but that could be the people's fault making them like that. Then you have got, I think. Which one should I do next? Oh, this one playing. This is like Zombie Steve. Um, I think everybody should know what he is as well. Everybody knows zombies like... Everybody should know what zombies are. <laughs> um, yep, you've got the head. It looks like Steve. That's a zombie version. There's only one thing. Why did they had the hair? Why does it look like Steve? That's one thing that I'm a little bit bummed about. But, yep. Oh, and also I have got this guy. Oh yeah, by the way, guys, I have got animals as well, like animal mobs in there, so I'm going to show you them. Make sure you, sti make sure you stick to the end to watch them. A creeper. Uh, these explode when a player is near them. And uh, I don't know what this writing is at the back. I've just noticed it when I've just turned it around. Let's wait for it to do its thing. No, it's not doing it. Well, um, but yeah, a creeper when a person's on it, either though they're mining. What they do is if they're mining, the creeper will come along and then just make a sound and they go boop and you and you take a lot of damage and you die within one shot if you have no armor or leather armor let's say let's try a, a th another mob i'm going through the hostile mobs and i'll go for the animals 
Um, here's a skeleton. I don't know if I've shown this in some of the videos, but skeleton. Also, if I get one of his. Oh, God, where is it now? Well, they can hold swords, by the way, if you wanted them to. Look. Okay. Look, you can see a jagged edge. They can hold swords as well, just like the wither skeleton. So you... But they don't fit really well in, or is it just my character? I don't know. But they can fit in, as you can see. But everybody should know what they really do is they hold bows and arrows. Just put it in there. Right. Like that. Bows and arrows, they shoot you and it keeps coming off. This guy's broke. I've had these for a few years though, like two years, three years. Well, actually, no, probably about a year, some of the new ones, but all the old ones are there. Let's go on to whatever. Ah, I've also got another skeleton as well. There's a reason why. Because if I get. Did I drop it in here? Not sure if I did or not. I think you guys should know what one of these are. If you don't, then I don't know. I don't know what life you're living in. I just. A spider! A spider obviously has eight eyes, some of them are dark, some of them are light red. Underboa, abdomen, see I know my insects. I'm looking over here because obviously there's phones like over here for you, like that's where I'm looking because I'm see if I'm doing it right. But yeah, there's that. So, and also what comes with it is a little spider saddle. You can fit only skeletons in this, but I, you usually get spider jockeys in easy, that's very, very rare, but in it's like hard mode, you do get them very often, common. I mean, okay, but what you can do, let me just show you. Obviously, let me just show you the butt of the skeleton. If you have this, that will fit. Let me just and you might have to slide it on i'm not sure but i just press it as hard as i can in it and there you go a spider jockey um and also you can just hold a bow and arrow if you want and boom you've got a spider jockey amazing i might create some uh animator like use these characters to make something because i did it with one of my cousins and she liked it so yeah. All right, let's move on. Oh, there's one human ant showing you, Alex. I always say this is Steve's girlfriend because I always think it is anyway. Because why not have a boy than a girl? Probably for girls out there. Remember, guys, use Alex if you're a girl if you want to, and boys can have him as well. Oh, all right. Hmm. Ah. This is one as well. Your boy, the witch. The witch group is down. This is a villager type witch. He can throw... But obviously it's like a female of the... Female bads of the thing. Yeah. Uh, he has four... Uh, not full, but he can take his head off. But I don't want to. But he does have like a actual cape. Like the type thing which I find really nice but there's that the head the little and if you guys oh my if you guys can see up see it on her nose that's the little wart right there the wart <laughs> all of them but oh yeah I've got two Alex's two creepers so one more hostile mob and then we'll go on to the things the zombie pig man Everybody knows when a pig gets struck by lightning in the overworld, they turn into a zombie pigman. These are hostile if you hit one of the other zombie pigmen, they'll all run after you in hordes. But 
articulation in the head is very, very good. It can only turn like this, or the waist would do it. It does that to some others as well, but articulation the same, and the arms, leg movement as wise. There. Nice. Right! Oh. Don't worry, guys, it was just a black sheet that was fine. Let's go on to what, the last type, human type guy. The Iron Golem. I did an animated video on one of these on one of my friend's channel. Speak. Uh, go and check out the channel Spinfire336, also known as and the Space 336. That's his YouTube channel. Make sure you check it out. Here is an Iron Golem. Full through... No. He's like a bodyguard for the villagers if any hostile mobs go near the villagers or a hostile mob does get near the villager the iron golem will walk slowly and then uh, pounces them in the air and probably destroy them and also to make an iron golem you need a pumpkin and four iron which cost an, an iron Nine iron, nine nine iron ingots makes one at one iron. So make sure you go mine if you want a bodyguard at my house in my survival world. I do have one, so uh, you can protect my house. Well, if I'm going mining or something, or a mob comes, I have got a cat, so creepers don't go near, and that's what cats do. do. Let's go to the animals finally. So. Here's a, this is not a hostile by the way, but you don't have to have a saddle on them, but you can put a saddle to make it look like you're riding them, but you can ride a, this is a skeleton horse, the recent update to Minecraft, like a year ago, as articulation wise, you can take this off, which looks like dark, right? You can move the up and down, up and down. The let's just put back this back on. The saddle, you can have Steve on stuff on it, but you can have the saddle off. And there's a little tail that can swing a little bit down here. Articulation can do a human and female. And he has a joint. I should do it with this one. He has a joint right there that can move it up and up like this way if you want it laying down but I but you can do nice running animations. Same with this leg, but you can't have it fully you can have like this bit up here, but you can't have like this bit go around so but it can move up and down. So yeah, you can have a a human like Steve or Alex riding it. Now let's go on to the last freakier version, the actual horse. By the way, if a horse gets struck by lightning, that's what turns him into a skeleton. But if a zombie bites the horse, that's what turns him into a zombie, which we haven't got yet. So that's one thing I'll get from Amazon. The head, oh yeah, can move up and down. Same with the skeleton. Same articulation uh, with the horse and the skirting horse. So it can move up and down, move it up if he wants to fart, which I think is a bit rude. So either I might get demonetized. <laughs> um, yeah. Now, who likes dogs and cats? Because I like cats, I like some dogs, and I don't mind any animal else. Let's go on to the ocelot. More like its tail, that's a little bit rude. This is an ocelot, it can be found in the jungle um, and stuff. Sorry if you can hear that noise, it's my mum. Mum, stop it now! Um, I'm doing something upstairs. But you can tame these with fish, but you need to crouch, they'll come towards you and press LT or L2 if you're on PS4, L2, LT if you're on Xbox. PC, I'm not sure because I never play PC on Minecraft. People might be being argued, but I don't play a lot of computer like computers. So here, 
Uh, he is the stop and can be tamed by fish. Articulation wise, he can move at full 360. I've just done the game accident. The little legs, they can only move in nowhere because it's actual plastic. With a tail though, it can move all the way up, it can move up, down, side, side. And yeah, let's move on to the dog if we can find it anywhere. I've got a lot of stuff out here. Wait a minute, I'm having some technical problems. Where's that dog? Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. Here's a villager, the blacksmith. These are the old villagers though. But there's new villagers which this should bring out no tool. Ah. Uh, let me just show you this one. You should know what these are, cows. You can kill them for leather. If you get four leather, you can make boots, which I always make them. If you get five leather, you can make um, a helmet. Eight leather, nine leather for a chest plate. Six leather for leggings. Yep. So there's the cow. Then there's the chicken. Um, and also the cow does have no, like, lot, a lot of articulation. The chicken there, which I find a little bit disturbing, you can turn this upside down if you want to, if you want to make it look crazy. Yeah, just click in there every time you do get it straight, so that's a good thing. The wings, if people, if say, they can actually flap, it's going to be like a slow forward chicken. Legs are plastic and they are joined. I don't know if you see that. Alright, and there's pigs that I do have. I've got two horses actually, I shouldn't have done that. So here's the saddle, uh, is the pig. Both of them have the same articulation. And here's the pig on the saddle, which you can use a carrot stick on. Sorry about that. You the head can move all the way up and back to normal. Legs can move forward a little bit and backwards. The front legs, same with that one. I don't know why they've. And the back legs can like a creeper. They can go like that, like that. Oh, this is annoying. There's a, supposed to be a dog in here. Oh, why is the dog going, Mike? I should know where the dog's gone. What is that? Oh! I got this off the little mob pack. This is a silverfish. You can make, if you make two blocks high instead of them, the silverfish can't get you. But try not my silverfish blocks uh, because what will happen is they will, silverfish will spawn if you break the block. I don't think anybody would want. Wait a minute. This is going to annoy me a bit. Wait a minute, I'm going to just try and find him. There he is. Ugh. A wolf. As you know, a wolf is normal. You, this is a tame wolf, but you can sit him down. If you do that, and then his front legs go backwards. You can have him like... A sitting dog if you wanted to the tail it can move side and side but not up and down but you can move it like a wagon tail it is a tame wolf but you can find non-tame wolves uh, articulation wise it's 436 there so I think that's everything let me just go and check a minute That's everything, so make sure you subscribe to Spitting Fire, um, which is his user, his YouTube channel is called Spitting Fire, with double T, um, 336 space 336, and when that's done, uh, you will find his YouTube channel, one of the videos might be called Hi Ryan, which is kind of strange, but yeah everything should be sorted so we'll see you on the next one so bye